Hello guys and welcome to if not one of my most professionally made videos perhaps one of the most exciting because today we're going to be I'm going to be re-watching the footage I got from the battle now for those who don't know I've joined the Torah for him and we are in a major war at the moment between the Coalition of Dawn so Dale, Arnor, Rohan, Gondor and the rest versus the Iron Pact Dol Amroth, Dol Guldur, Dunland, and the Torofarim. If you're thinking that sounds like a weird alliance, it is. Now, I was on the battle 26th, so Sunday, and um, I had a ton of fun, but because of the nature of the, um, you know, of the scenario, I wasn't able to just record a normal video. So instead, I just recorded everything that happened, and we're going to be looking at... Basically, I'm going to be re-watching the whole thing and showing you guys some of the most interesting bits. So we're going to start right at the start, just when I turned the recording on. And, um, yep. this is the start. This is, this is terrible, I'm going to be honest. So, I, you will hear keyboard and stuff going, but... Um, I cut off the mic in a little bit. So the start was really awkward, in that several of the troop, several of the people on our side, had far too many units. And as you can see, if we just pop back there, yeah, this this was an issue. Someone brought half trolls. When I was TP'd into the dome, the five um, banner bearers I'd brought. All killed instantly and uh, there goes the mic so it it didn't go very well so the start took a very very long time so I ain't gonna skip until something so I'm gonna be back when something interesting happens. okay so as you can see we're 22 minutes into a 45 minute recording and the battle still hasn't started yet. It was even worse than this in real life. By this point, it must have been about 45 minutes after the battle was meant to start. Unfortunately, uh, the players on our side weren't very good at bringing the right amount of units. So, yeah, this is the next interesting thing that happened. I don't know how, uh, I can't remember how, but turns out I had negative Angmar alignment. So, these random troops that spawned, because we were in, I think it's Enedwai, if you can actually see it in the top, I'm pointing at it as if you can see my fingers. But yeah, I, I got attacked by a group of hillmen. This was the first time I got to try out my hammer though, so it got that. But yeah, I... I yeah, so this is about as interesting as it got for 45 50 minutes because prior to that we had just been standing there and there goes that excitement as as you see it's about as fast as the battle of the Somme so back when the battle actually begins and here we go the battle has just begun. Now it take I didn't actually see it in chat, so it takes me a minute to realise that the battle has begun. So I'm standing here, still waiting. And um I I look up And yeah, mo most of our team haven't really realised the battle started. So there, there you go. You can see on the side there the Dol Amroth, and I'm like, wait, is the battle started? And as you can see, it has. We are all running straight up to this hill that we've got. Because we're actually defending here. Dunland is under attack by Arnor. 
And as you can see, I've brought some equipment. I'm going to eat my suspicious meat. And I'm going to get into the tree. Now, the battle rules are pretty weird because we're allowed to build, but... And, and as you can see, it more, more of Arnold trying to... Uh, Angmar, sorry, trying to kill me. Um, and we were getting... The voice chat at this point was absolute chaos because there was a voice chat going on um, and it was like there was one guy trying to yell at everybody to be quiet and just listen to um, someone else. And it was, it was, because we, we were all digging this big trench, and he was just going, don't dig trenches, don't dig trenches, don't dig trenches. You know, build a wall, build a wall, build a wall. Like, honestly, he and Donald Trump would get along great. But, <laughs> it was just, there was absolutely no controlling this. Um, and the voice chat, by the way, is the reason that you're relying on this post commentary. Um, voice chat was very much not family friendly. And um, as such, I was just not dealing with trying to censor words or God even knows. And um, also, my, my commentary sucked. Um, I was pretty focused on trying to win the battle rather than actually, um, you know, commentating. So, as you can see, I've just built this little sniper tower on top of this tree, and we're, we're getting yelled at, because there's a rule, the, um, both in chat and in voice chat at this point, we're getting yelled at by the admins. Um, being told, you know, there's the rules about building for this are fairly. Um, what's the what's the word? Vague. So it's like you're allowed to build, but you can't build like an entire base. So, yeah, we just built a massive trench complex. So I think we did go a little bit far. As you can see, it's a bit ridiculous. So we've got like four different walls and um, the admins at this point are trying to um, knock down bits of the walls um, in order to, you know, balance it. And uh, basically the admins are going along and going, nope. Uh, the players are repairing it constantly as the admins try to break it to balance it a bit. As as you can see, this the actual battle's fairly short. Because, you know, the opening took so long. But yeah, the wall's a bit ridiculous basically. Now it takes good or the coalition of dawn a little while. As you can see I'm getting some screenshots you know, and you can see them, right? There they are, coming down the middle, between those big rocks. And they've got a flood of troops coming all the way down. Uh, it, this is the point it starts to get a, a little bit out of control. Um... Because it's like basically the moment that um, we actually saw good players, the first thing that got shouted like half a dozen times was, you know, don't let. Um, it was like, don't waste your arrows, don't waste your arrows, don't waste your arrows, don't waste your arrows, don't shoot, don't shoot, conserve them. As you, um, and, you know, 
We're getting yelled at by the admins to stop building the wall, stop building the wall. Our own team is yelling, stop using arrows, stop using arrows. And it's just absolutely gone to hell. Nobody even knows what's going on anymore. Um, as you can see though, we've got a lot of troops all the way down the line. And here come, here they come. You can see them behind that big rock. And I am going to start opening fire with uh, poison arrows and um, as you can see it's there's there's no real risk here it's like yeah you might get shot a bit but as you'll see later I'll get shot pretty bad and it doesn't do much in in the making of that screenshot I accidentally dropped my bow because I'm professional um, and it's pretty much it's oh 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 as you can see we're getting flanked by the bloke with the big club um and it's we're just holding this ridiculous wall that we've got because that's what it is it's absolutely ridiculous We've just basically built the Great Wall of China out of dirt. And except for on one side, which we'll see in a little bit, uh, we weren't able to defend before the admins started, you know, yelling at us to stop. And in fact, you can see in the chat, well, you won't be able to see because I'll have to have it all um, censored and stuff. Uh, but... Um, uh, one of them, one of the admins just uh, said, this isn't Fortnite. This isn't about just pressing building and then shooting. Though that appears to be pretty much all that's happening. Um, we've, as you can see, I'm not super, I don't have a ton of stuff on me. Um... And I'm sort of just waiting to get a nice shot. Um, because there aren't really any opportunities for a good shot here. Just some nice screen shots. As you can see, they're building a wooden wall. Which makes our dirt wall look absolutely rubbish. Not very far from us. And there you go. I get hit by an arrow. Yeah. The arrows do absolutely nothing with this level of gear that um, we all got prepared for the battle. Uh, I didn't get this gear, by the way. I didn't do any of the hard work here. Um, I was equipped by uh, someone else. I didn't get any of the gear. Um, not going to pretend like I actually did any of the grinding. The Sword of Command, which you saw in my inventory very briefly there, and the five soldiers, that was me. Everything else, and the flint and steel, and the meat, and the tools. But the weapons and the armor, uh, and the brews, those weren't me. So, you know, don't want to pretend like I did any of the hard work here. I just sort of got paid to go and have fun in a battle. So... As you can see, it's just a kind of crazed exchange of fire. And, yeah, this is how pretty much most of the battle went. Um, good slowly, the Coalition of Dawn, or the COD, slowly approaching as we um, sort of just keep shooting. And, um, as you can see, they are making a big push down the west flank. Uh, you can see the four people along there, out of fortifications, while um, sort of this big group with their little wooden building in the centre keep us occupied. And I have, I'm forced to basically run around and grab arrows. Now, Dol Amroth is currently complaining in the chat because nobody on their side has positive Gondor alignment. And they brought Dol Amroth troops, which means if they let them loose, um, it's not going to go well for anyone. And there you can see I did take some damage from that arrow because I got knocked off my pillar and nearly, 
I could have died there because I got knocked off in front of the wall. And as you can see, we've got a massive approach coming down the middle. Um, and there's none dead by this point. No casualties. <sighs> that is a silly shot. As you can see, I'm down to almost half health. And I have been hit by three arrows. Arrows? Arrows by this point. So, it's a pretty high survivability. And I'm just digging myself a little hole here. So, the idea is I can't be hit um, anywhere near as badly. So, you know, if I get hit, I can just sit here and be fine. Uh, you know, they won't be able to shoot me while I'm out there. And you can see we've still got troops pushing up the center, getting in our face. But um, this isn't our big problem. Um, they've got two walls here. But um, we are having, in the voice chat, constant cries about how terrible the west flank is going and how it needs support. So I head out to the west flank and go... Oh my god, this was way worse than I expected. Because there is five or six Coalition of Dawn players out here. Um, fighting against our four or five Dol Amroth ones. Uh, so we're outnumbered. Um, they all have, you know, super good gear and everything. Um, and this is where we weren't any able to build anywhere near as good fortifications and you can see they've got elves here as well because uh, uh, and um, the wall is really poorly built here so um, you can be sh almost anywhere you can still be shot by an from another angle and we'll see just how badly that goes later but you can see we've got a naturally um, spawning wooden house uh, ruined building here um, which we've sort of incorporated into the defences as much as we can. But it's still not going well on this flank. They're pushing up to that little lake in the corner. We're being, you know, they've built a little wooden fortification. I am getting some hits in. Um, but the west flank is completely collapsing. They've got seven or eight players by this point. All with their troops, including several elvish archers. And they are just able to keep pouring fire down on us. And it's just impossible to hold that position. Um, I went out to grab an arrow there. Didn't go very well. I did actually get hit. And you see I get hit there again. And I, I actually get pretty low health. I go hide in my little cubby hole. Um, that I dug for just this purpose. Um, but you can see it's absolutely going to... Like, it's not going well for us at this point. Um, we've sort... They're sort of starting to push around pretty heavily around our west flank. Their centre has very much weakened, but that's pretty much no use to us. Because we are just desperately trying to hold our position. Rather than, rather than attacking. If we were on the offensive and they'd done the same thing, we might be doing better. But the issue is... That uh, both our flanks are really poorly defended. Um, the west flank is definitely the stronger of the two. If they'd pushed around the east flank, it would have been, you know, GG. Um, especially considering the west flank has the ruined structure and the lake as sort of natural defenses. But it's going very, very badly. And as you can see, the Dol Amroth guys were just forced to pull out. So I am. Um, you know, we've been told to pull back from the west flank, and there's like one guy who said he's serving as a distraction. So I've headed to try and do a similar thing. Sort of pull some attention for a little bit. Just try and get them to focus on me rather than anybody else. Um, you know, rather than attacking the Dol Amroth guys who still have troops and are certainly better at PvP than I am. And as you can see there, I get hit quite badly. I pull back, uh, trying to get out of there. 
but I'm still just trying to make sure that they are forced to duck, basically. I'm not trying to kill them, just stop them shooting. Um, but I do get shot at quite badly. Um, you can see I nearly got hit there. I'm behind the tree, I'm grabbing arrows everywhere, that's sort of my main aim here. Because, uh, you know, trying to make sure I've always got arrows, you know, more than enough arrows to shoot at people. Um, they've actually started throwing troops at the east flank as well at this point. But it's, you know, as night falls, the west flank is basically gone. The west wall, you know. <laughs> you can see I get a nice shot there. Just trying to harass those centre troops for a bit. But, um, you know... At this point, it's pretty hard to see how the battle could go in our favour. We've completely lost one flank. That just happened to me. Where, I, as you can, you can, you know, there's the hard proof that people are coming up the east flank. Um, but it's really the west flank that we have to worry about at this point. You know, there are maybe there are so many players, and none of us are holding here um, we are just desperately trying to keep control and there you go I get hit by two arrows I hide back here in an attempt to not be able to be shot uh, and I am just waiting to heal up a bit before I try and make a runner because two arrows and that's it so I'm just sort of waiting, healing up a bit. As you can see, I'm getting dozens of arrows shot by our own troops directly above my head. And there we go. I take three arrows. And that's it. Because basically once you're dead, you're dead. That's it. So, now, that was the end of my battle. I was the second casualty of the entire thing and our first. Now... I wish I could say we somehow miraculously turned it around, but we didn't. The west flank fell, and with it the centre, and they just sort of pushed through. Um, we did last quite a lot longer than I did, but we did lose pretty badly. Now, uh, I'm going to try and... So, that's it for today's video, and I will see you guys next time, where hopefully... We don't lose another battle horrendously. I will see you guys next time. Bye!